Hello guys, welcome to What V Want, a technology vlog. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to fix raw partition without losing data using EasyUS. For more information about this tutorial, visit our article. Link provided in the description. If you are new to our channel, click on red color subscribe button and turn on notification for regular updates. Without any delay, let's get started. Firstly, visit the official site of EasyUS. Check description for the link. Download and install the EasyUS Data Recovery Wizard on your computer. Launch the application and you will find the interface as showing in the tutorial. Here, all the drives connected to your computer will be shown. Move the cursor onto the drive which you want to fix. Then you will find the scan option as showing in the tutorial. Click on scan option. Then it starts the scanning process and redirect you to the window as showing. The status of scanning will be seen at the bottom of the window. After the completion of scanning, it organizes the files and shows you status as indicated. It shows all the data present in that drive. Choose the important data by checking the boxes beside the file or folder. And, click on Recover option located at the bottom right of the window. Then a window will pop up. Choose the destination from that window to recover the files. And click on Select Folder option. Then it starts recovery process. After the completion of recovery process, it shows the notifications as recovery complete. Click on the View Recovered option to check the recovered files. Check whether the files are recovered correctly or not. Later, right-click on this PC and click on Manage option from the Options list. Then you are redirected to the Computer Management window. From options available on the left side of the window, select the Disk Management, which is under the Storage section. Then, you will find all the drives with all the details. Locate the external USB drive from that list. Right-click on it and click on Delete Volume option to delete the partition. Then, create a new partition and format it to NTFS format. That's it, from now you can access the USB normally. If you want to know more about partition, check description for the article link. Hope you like this tutorial. For more information, visit our article. Link provided in the description. Subscribe to the channel for more interesting videos, and don't forget to hit the bell icon.